Okay. Clarify with the same cards I got. <laughs> All right. So, okay. There could be someone that is pretty much showing a lot of care to another individual or other in individuals. And um, I'm also hearing that you guys could be doing something of humanity, Leo. I'm also hearing charity work. Maybe there could be somebody that could be doing something in regards of, I'm hearing the community. Or this could be other people, Leo, that could be doing something to, like, giving you something. But we're going to clarify so we can get a full aspect of things. And this is saying that they want to do it. Whoever this is, they want to do this. Maybe you did this because you, you did care. Like I said, you cared about somebody in particular or somebody cared about you. You know what I'm getting, Leo? What you did for somebody, I'm hearing that it kind of put like an effect on that person. Whether this is a good effect or a bad thing. Or it may have, they may have did something to you, but I got a feeling, Leo, that this is somebody that you once cared about, Leo. And, and I'm hearing the way y'all met, it was like you was giving your all, like your all. Like you didn't even have to fully know this person. You just was giving them your whole, you know, true self. You, you gave them your heart. I'm hearing your mind, your body, your soul. But I'm hearing that what you did to, for this person, it left some form of effect on them, Leo. Your kindness, your compassion, um, Leo, because says humanity, kindness or compassion for others. You really cared about somebody. I'm hearing what you did, it left some form of effect on this person because they know that you really cared about them. We got the Knight of Cups, clarifying humanity. We got the Two of Wands with implement and then we need one more card but i got a feeling leo what you did for somebody out of the kindness of your heart it, it really did leave some form of effect on this person emotionally spiritually whatever however it has happened but we got justice reversed so you know it's crazy because i got a feeling that leo whatever you did for somebody from the kindness of your heart this person that you cared for some of y'all, this person could have been a flat-out stranger. Um, the rest of you guys, I'm getting, for the most part, somebody that you have grown to know. But I feel like this person may have some form of feelings for you. They, they fell in love with you. That's exactly what I'm hearing. What you did for this person, it got this person in love with you for real. They did have some, some, some feelings for you, or maybe they still do. But... Most of y'all, they still do love you because, like I said, it has some form of effect. You left some form of um, effect on this person, and now you got them wanting to come back. Some of y'all's person owe you an apology. It could be a water sign, a fire sign, or it could be a Libra. But whatever they got to say to you, Leo, it has something to do with y'all, you know, coming together. Whether y'all being together, partner up together, being friends, I don't know. But it has something to do with y'all being together because what they have done to you, Leo, they got bad karma for it. They got bad karma for it because we got will and then we got justice reversed. This person got bad karma for taking advantage of your heart. That's exactly what I just heard. They took advantage of your heart, your kindness, Leo. And um, like I said, it left some form of an effect on them. And I feel like the effect is emotionally and material-wise. It, it may have changed their life in a way. But let's dive deep in this situation and see what else is taking place or has taken place. Because most of y'all probably didn't even take place yet as far as this person coming forward. But you just don't know how 
this person didn't know how powerful you was. That's what they did. They didn't know that. I'm hearing this person was messing with the wrong one. Whoever this is. They definitely was messing with the wrong Leo. Or maybe you could be the cross watcher. Maybe you could be the water sign or another fire sign or a Libra that could be cross watching for Leo. Y'all take what resonates. But it's saying that your person, they got paid, they got karma for what they have done to you. And it's sad because I feel like your person do, do love you. But what they have done to you, it backfired. It, it did. It backfired. Maybe your person thought that they was going to get away with it. Yeah, this is something that they cannot avoid, Leo. They cannot avoid the feelings that they have for you. You know, um, they cannot avoid what's happening in their life. It was like, it was meant to be with this wheel card. It was meant to be, for real, for real. But we got the Tower Reverse. We got the Nine of Swords Reverse. And we got the Eight of Swords Reverse. Yeah, your person going to come back with some form of apology. Um a confession or an explanation or maybe they could be expressing how they really feel about you Leo because I feel like they just not ready for it to end and um I feel like this is somebody that decided to shove their feelings down Leo about you far as your the emotions that they feel for you and they was avoiding for waking up, Leo. That's exactly what I heard when I see the Knight of Cups in the Tower reverse. When I seen these cards, when I look at these cards, I heard your person, you were supposed to wake this person up, Leo. Spiritually wake this person up, but they avoided that. So instead of them acknowledging the feelings that they had for you, they just decided to do you wrong and walk away from the, the feelings they have for you and everything else that comes with you, which is your kind heart, right? The, the person that you are, the good person that you are, but um, it was unavoidable. They realized that no matter the feelings that they have for you or who you were as a person, that's just something that they cannot unsee, you know, and now they want to come back together with you. Some of you guys, your person may have, a, um, maybe y'all had a business partnership with this person, or maybe you still do have a business partner with this person, but I'm not getting that. It says plans, partnership, influence. You was a in good influence in this person's life, Leo. You are. I feel like you've always been. I'm hearing somebody that this person can look up to you, up to whether man or woman, doesn't matter of age or any of that. I just felt like you, you were somebody of an influence. Some of you guys could be influencers, whether you are somebody on. Um, I'm getting spotlight energy, so maybe you are. Somebody who's on YouTube, somebody who is on Instagram or TikTok, or um, maybe you could be a healer in some way. Maybe you could be working in a spiritual community. Some of y'all are definitely are people of that nature, but I'm, I'm seeing that it backfired. What they had did to avoid waking up, to avoid seeing you for who you were, were it, it it definitely did backfire in their life and um it's crazy because they feel like coming together with you will not only I feel like coming together with you it will resolve the sleepless nights that they may be having because your person who was haunted the whole entire time by what they have done to you because like I said your person you left an effect on this person like a huge effect on this person life and it's just unavoidable they cannot avoid what they see they cannot avoid what they see. They cannot avoid what they are going through, you know, but they do feel like coming together with you, Leo, and um, making some form of a compromise or, what, or whatever, whether this is a renewal of a friendship, a business partnership, a relationship, or maybe everything, right? They, they, they just want to get that off their chest, put it like that, because they know that what they're going through right now without that apology, without that explanation or whatever they got to say to you, or they need to say to you, it's going to continue to fall down in their life, Leo, if they don't get something off of their chest because they've been bothered by it for a while, you know, but like I said, them coming together with you, they just feel like they don't have nothing else to worry about after they do come together with you with this apology or explanation or confession or whatever, but 
I'm, I'm saying it was definitely meant to be what will and justice reverse far as them getting their karma from treat from mistreating you leo yeah this person some of this person could be getting out of jail if this is somebody that was in jail but it like i said i just felt like even seeing you like being around you or whatever or talking to you they just feel like that will resolve some of the stuff that they are going through because they kind of feel guilty. Even though I'm not seeing no guilt cards right here, but I feel like your person kind of feel bad and they know that the effect that you have left on their life was is a great deal to them, you know, because they know that what they have done to you was wrong. They know that, you know, and like I said, this person is breaking free from whatever it is that been cons consciously on their mind. That has something to do with them doing you wrong. Yep. They not say it was some form of guilt. They knew exactly what they was doing. They knew what they was doing to you was wrong, Leo. But let's dive deeper in the situation and see what else is taking place. Like I said, some of y'all could be dealing with an air sign, a fire sign, or a water sign. You know what? I'm going to pull I'm going to pull some of that next. But yeah, just know that you was a great deal in this person's life, for real, for real. You meant a lot to this person more than they have showed you, Leo. And, and it's sad that this person knew they had feelings for you. So instead of taking, accepting you and, you know, embracing your, you know, who you are as a person and the love that they have for you, they turned around and just did you, they did you wrong and, and just ran and just ran that's that's crazy but it caught up to him spirit caught up to them leo we got the king of pentacles reverse yeah i just felt like wow i don't feel like this person can't give you what you want though yes they they coming back to get some things off their chest about, you know, how they did you or whatever because of the guilt and what they're going through. But I don't know why. Some of y'all, your person probably lack accountability. Some of you guys, they just don't want that responsibility of being in love with you. They, they just don't want to. Some of you guys, your person's afraid of being vulnerable. Now I'm seeing it. Your person just afraid of being vulnerable. So, Instead of, like I said, embracing the love they have for you, they just decided not to do anything about it, like not to do anything for you, to show you physically that they do love you. So they choose to hide it. But just know your person do want you to stay. They do. So this is somebody that's kind of basically a scared of the love that you was giving them. They were afraid of your love, whatever love that you, because like I said, y'all came in with open arms, open hands, Leo, when you met this person. Like, you probably didn't even know this person from a can of paint. You were just being your true, authentic self and showing mad love and respect for this person and doing any and everything for this person, Leo. And they couldn't take that. They couldn't take that because the more you gave to this person, the more that they started to fall in love with you, Leo. And it scared them. It definitely did scare them. So what they did, once again, was that whatever they did that was deceptive that they did to you, they did that and they left. But like I said, spirit caught up to them because of you left a big effect on this person's life and their heart, Leo. And they have not been able to get you out of their mind because they knew that you are somebody that they actually, you know, bring them back to life from here in alignment. Like, you supposed to wake this person up. When I look at the two of wands, I look at alignment. That's exactly what I heard, alignment. Like, you supposed to get this person back on track in regards of their life, getting their life together. But since they effed up what they had with you and ran with it, karma, karma bit them in the butt, basically. You know, but it is saying that your person holding back from actually physically showing you. They got a problem... Of physically showing you that they do love you, Leo. Even though they want you to stay, once again. Some of y'all I'm hearing this person will open up until you open up. Because they don't want to make it seem like they're trying to manipulate you. They don't want to make it seem like they're trying to finesse you or, you know, or any of that. You know, I feel like your person do... They're just afraid. They're afraid of being vulnerable and actually physically showing you, 
you know, how they really feel about you, Leo. But I'm hearing that you change this person's life and they, I'm hearing outlook on, on things in their life, Leo. Let's pull some of these out of time cards. But their way of doing it is like, like I said, with the two of wands, it's all about, you know, coming together and getting grounded. You know, doing the right thing, basically. That's all they want. They just want to do the right thing. Yeah, they want to give you clarity because we got the sword in rose. Your person wants to give you, they want to be, they want to tell you the truth, Leo. Like I said, they don't want to come in and try to manipulate things or any of that because they feel like they don't have to do that because that's not what their intention is to do because they already, Spirit already told their tail up for deceiving you before and they, now they know not to mess with you. But the truth is getting ready to be exposed with this person. Some clarity is being given to you, Leo. We got Cupid's arrow, half faith, love is coming, surprise invitation or meeting, hesitation. So some of you guys, whatever they got to say to you, some of you guys' person could be a bit hesitant once again to open up. Because even when they do approach you, they still may not, they still could be a bit closed off, put it like that, Leo. I don't know what they may say to you. Maybe they just could just be coming in like, hi, stranger, blase, blase, right? It could be something of that sort. Um, but, but in reality, what their mind is telling them, they really want to express how they really feel about you, to be honest, Leo. And they want to apologize. But like I said, your person feels weak if they do that. First of all, they feel weak. You make them feel weak. And I'm not saying in a bad way. I feel like in a good way far as them having feelings for you. And um, on top of that, they just want to do it the right way. They just want to make sure you still feel the same way like they feel. You know, and um, they, they don't want to have to like try to manipulate anything. They want to just do, go with the flow and see how you feel first. It's like they're trying to feel you out first and see if you still love them before they say anything. But like I said, there is some form of truth and clarity that is getting ready to be spoken from one of y'all. And um, yeah, your person a bit hesitant because they're afraid of you not feeling the same way anymore, Leo. And um, yeah, and it's crazy because this is somebody that lacks self-confidence, Leo. They do. They, they know that they feel, well, to them, they feel like they're not enough, Leo. You know, and um. They in a lot of fear. I'm not even going to lie. This person is in a lot of fear, Leo, because this is a risk right here. This is something that they never done before. We got hand of cards, taking a chance, risk, being strategic, options, not showing hand, gambling. But I feel like this is just something that they never done before because they never was the type of person to open up and tell somebody how they flat out really feel about them without ghosting them you see what i'm saying because i feel like some of y'all's person did ghost you some of you guys it, it, this person ghosted you the rest of you guys they may have deceived you and you just maybe you just decided to call it quits and you just left y'all take what resonates but i am getting that energy where this is just something that your person is not really used to doing and that's opening up to you because they already feel like they already effed up they already they know they messed up they don't have to mess with you leo they gonna do it the right way though they is but they're trying to fill you out to see if you still love them because they don't want it to be a one-sided situation. Yeah, this person gained a lot of respect for you, Leo. I feel like they always had a lot of respect for you. And you know what's crazy? Your person knows that you are marriage material. They know that. Some of y'all this person may have had somebody else a side piece or a mistress in the background of y'all connection, Leo, whether y'all was married or not, right? But maybe it was a third person. Some of y'all's person could be telling you the truth and letting you know that there was another person involved. Some of y'all's person could be flat out telling you that they are still married or that they are married because some of y'all probably didn't ever know that this person was married. But we got privileged lady with the sword with the rose. So yeah, there's definitely some truth that is getting ready to be known. And um, yes, they have a lot of, they do look at you as somebody who is very valuable. Like I said, this person just lacks self-confidence. They feel like they're not good enough for you, Leo. You know, but they, they're willing to make a change. You know, they're willing to, 
even though they may be a bit hesitant on you know what to do or whatever or if they should open up they are willing to take that risk because we did see that car and, and make that change no matter the frustration that they feel it's like I'm, I'm they under a lot of pressure right now Leo that's exactly how I'm feeling they, the person is under a lot of pressure because they're not used to doing it it's something different to them yeah because they really want to be with you they want some of y'all's person actually do want to move in with you we got change and then we got main male or it can be female it doesn't even matter but um some of y'all that's exactly what i'm seeing they could be some of y'all this person is involved with somebody else they could be literally getting ready to walk away to be with you y'all take what resonates especially if you know this person tell you about another person or if you already knew about another person